After allegations of misappropriation of funds were leveled against his trust, Law Minister Salman Khurshid has hit back. In a fact-by-fact -fact rebuttal of the new sting, Khurshid has demanded a probe into the media group, claiming it violated journalistic ethics. The media group, meanwhile, has released a statement sticking by its stick. Hours after his fact-by-fact -fact defence, against allegations made against his trust, Salman Khurshid demanding a probe into a news channel sting operation. Pending an inquiry, what should you do? It is a family-run trust. You are the head of the trust. You are the law minister of India. You are in a powerful position. Yeah, I think the channel also should be probed as to how they went and got these kind of unsubstantiated and obviously, obviously very, very tricky uh, statements. Also referring to a letter, he said, was written to him by the channel. Tell me, Mr. Kushi, did the media group write to you a day before the broadcast? You say that they felt that this was at the most corruption at some lower level in the trust that you cannot be blamed for. Where is that letter? Yes, yes, yes. And also, also, and has also a, a wish expressed that, they, that he wished that there would be more people like me in politics. Um, not because he thought that uh, we would be able to feed them more stories, but because he thought that I was good. The law minister's countercharge evoking a statement from the media group in which it stood by its sting. Khurshid's wife Louise, the project director and the trust, reiterating the demand for an inquiry into allegations of fake affidavit and letters containing forged signatures of the UP government officials. We have approached the uh, UP government saying we want an inquiry. We knew that there was a problem and we ourselves approached the government of UP to inquire into this problem and we didn't do it now after the, after the story came out. We approached the Chief Minister first in, in uh, August. The counter-offensive by Khurshid raising the question, who is at fault now? Bureau Report Times Now.